Before turning to the dark side, Dooku was once a Jedi. He was an expert swordsman and was the master to Qui-Gon Jinn. Together they went on many missions, but over the years Dooku started to see the flaws in the Jedi Order. Within the first decade of Supreme Chancellor Palpatine's rule, Count Dooku emerged as the face of the Separatist movement, rallying systems to his cause, though some planets resisted his entreaties. On Geonosis, he conspired with other leaders to construct a massive droid army that would overwhelm the Republic. He was surprised to find, however, that Obi-Wan Kenobi had made his way to the system while on mission. Once the Jedi was captured, Dooku claimed he was glad to meet him and asked for his help. The reason Dooku joined the Separatists, he said, was that he learned a terrible truth. A Sith Lord called Darth Sidious controlled the Senate. With Obi-Wan at his side, they could destroy the Sith. I'll never join you, Dooku, the Jedi said. Dooku coldly left Obi-Wan in his cell. Later, Dooku and the Geonosians planned to execute Obi-Wan as well as Anakin Skywalker and Padme Amidala in their massive arena. The three staved off the beasts unleashed upon them, which gave the Jedi and their new clone army time to stage an attack. Thus marked the start of the Clone Wars, with both sides suffering heavy losses. bid to escape, Dooku rode a speeder to a nearby hangar, but was followed by Obi-Wan and Anakin. The Separatist leader ignited his red-bladed lightsaber, evidence that he had in fact turned Sith, and struck Anakin with a powerful shot of forced lightning. Arrogant and eager for combat, he taunted them both, ultimately wounding Obi-Wan and severing Anakin's right arm. Ready to finish the Jedi, Dooku stopped when he heard familiar footsteps. Yoda had arrived. The Sith claimed to be more powerful than any Jedi, but Yoda easily absorbed his forced lightning attack. Much to learn you still have, he said. With that, the two fought a furious lightsaber duel, which ended with Dooku making a hasty exit. This is just the beginning, he warned. The former Jedi fled the system and landed in an unmarked dwelling on Coruscant. Greeted by the evil Darth Sidious. I have good news for you, my lord, he said. War has begun. Excellent, Lord Sidious responded. Everything is going as planned. Thank you for watching. Tune in next time to hear another story. May the Force be with you, always.